dear student as i was discussing in the first video that in the font in what type of uh, what are the things that i have taught you that means i have taught you to find and replace fill and error check okay font using now i am teaching you the font using uh, the colors i have teach i have taught you how to implement the different patterns of bullets in the document so all these thing you must implement in your work and you have to do that particular work and those the thing what i am saying to you from your book also you can write down the steps or at the time of doing you write down the steps in your copy so that when you need to write the answer from now onwards you know and put it in your mind that you have to write the answer in a step wise all the steps should be clearly mentioned like what is the steps to change the font what you will write that first you will going to select the area step number 1 step number 2 you will go to the home menu you will click on the home menu and there in the bracket you will write by default the home home menu is selected okay after that you will write in the, in the home menu under the ribbon there will be one font group in the font group there is a option where the pattern of writings are available and the size of writings are also available that i'll teach you now now how to change what is a shortcut for it control plus shift plus f and this is control plus shift plus p so shift plus p for the number that you want to change now you want to change this number suppose you want to change the number is suppose you want to change the size of this one okay how to change it? let us go here okay again the drop down menu will come the window will open in front of you now let us let me check uh, the different style of writing uh, let me check the style of writing here okay now this is not so much visible uh, to you you cannot cope up with it okay so any pattern of writing you can select any uh, type of writing you can select that which is visible suppose i am selecting this one now i am making it bold now see here here i have got the option of selecting the size suppose i have selected the size 20 under that i select the color of this particular font what the color i am selecting let me select the bold color so that it can be visible to you also this is the blue color i have selected now i want to underline it okay i want to underline it with a different type suppose this wavy underline segment now what will be the wavy underline segment color let us select the wavy underline segment color no it is not so much visible uh, it is not so much visible let us take little bit color bold of it or you can go for the more colors okay or more color option i am taking this one red red is uh, or this one or this violet co uh, blue color i am taking blue with blue is also not so much matching uh, then green color okay so green color you can take this green color or you can take the this particular color which is the uh, oxidate color now set the default setting text effect if you want to give any type of text effect click on it text effect so text effect see here different pattern of text effect will going to come here okay fill the text suppose this one okay shadow then reflect glow suppose glow okay what color you want to glow what pattern of glowing suppose this pattern of glowing you want to choose you choose this pattern of glowing from here color effect suppose i am taking by default this color what it is little brighter so i am taking size 18 point okay then press it in okay then okay let's see what the change is coming here have you seen it see now the background color has been changed the effect has been changed and the pattern or writing has been changed so this is how we can use the different type of fonts in the particular document so it is totally depend on you that what is your thought how you will going to work it and what i say i'll show you the shortcut i'm quickly showing you the shortcut suppose this